Okay, unboxing and a little details of the social light. This is the mini portable one. It came in this box inside this big envelope. I like this. Packaged well. <clears throat> You're going to get a card that gives you a little bit of details. A picture instruction, fail proof. And also written instructions. The light takes, it does not come included with the batteries. The light comes included with this, but it takes two AAA batteries and it has three light settings. At the end of the video, I'm going to turn off all my lights so you can see it even more. Okay. And you see it's in there pretty good. So in shipping, believe me, it's not doing nothing. Here's your little remote control uh, button thing. And this comes off so you can um, push uh, to stop, uh, focus, film, picture, what have you. And then it pops back in. Okay. Here's the tripod. Here's the tripod. I'm going to take a picture and it will be posted with a video of it set up. And then this is where you put your camera, your, you can put your camera, you can put a pad. Um, it, it's very, um, this is not the review, it's just the, you know, unboxing. But just give you an idea. So you got four pieces that come with it. All quality, all quality. Okay, let me show you. Turn the lights up. Let me turn it off. Setting one. Setting two. Setting three. I decided to go ahead and just real quickly uh, set this up for you guys. <clears throat> With this tripod piece here, see it goes down like this. Or up. And it holds pretty good. Okay, but what I wanted to do was show you something. I'm going to go ahead and leave it up like this. On this ball piece right here that moves around, this piece comes up. And that's what's going to screw into the bottom of this, not the top piece. you got a screw piece here and one there, the one that's indented. You're going to take that one. Screw that straight in. You know, this is very good material. I think I paid like 50 bucks for this thing. I got to get the exact price. I got it off the social lighting website on some advertisement they did. Okay. Anyways, it's going to go. I love that. How fast you can do that. Okay. It's going to go like that. And what you're going to do is you're going to tighten it up in the position that you want. Right here. I'm going to do it straight up just so you can see. Okay. Then this piece, this is only for cell phones. Um, I made a mistake in my unboxing and said for your pads. You get another one that's like this that does the pads and the cell phones. But if you already have this, just get the other one if you want. It doesn't matter. They, uh, social lighting sells it. And then just, um, just screw this, hold this, and screw this in like that. So you got it nice and snug. Now what you're going to see, it's going to do this. And then you got your button right here on the side to tighten it however you want it. And not tighten it, you just lock it in place. So, however you want. And then this clips on, pretend this is my cell phone. Pretend my cell phone was in there. This would clip on to that. I had a small one that is a portable one. You could plug in your USB or you just take this and plug into your lighting. And uh, social, 
I believe this is a social lighting item. I can't remember, but I got it for Christmas one year, and it does work really good for, you know, just selfies and stuff, but uh, this is a must-have. <laughs> so I just want to set that up for you guys, and then if you want, you know, lock this in place. Moves. I'll show you another thing. If you unscrew that to loosen it, you know, you can maneuver it any way you want in any direction, you know, and the same with this. Okay. What I do want to show you is on this, you do have to screw it in or unscrew it to open it, and it only unscrews so far for your cell phones. So um, you're, you're going to have to go in different... Uh, you know, like ways you put your phone in there and then tighten it in. It's not one of those you just push in and it snug fits. You have to kind of do it yourself. But uh, for 50 bucks, I'm pretty sure that's what I paid, $39.99 or $50. Um, for the quality, I tell you, I'm surprised that was the price. It is definitely good quality and very functionable. I highly, highly, highly recommend it. Um, you'll see me doing some still shot vlogs on it because this is my camera. <laughs> so I need that to... Okay, I want to give you my review on the social lighting. This is a selfie stick, and I did an opening of the box and kind of gave you some details on it. Okay, what I want to mention is this stand right here. And again, this is a selfie stick, so it's not made to be a high-sitting thing. One thing I couldn't get it to do was this. Okay. My video's not wonky. When you go to put it, and I don't care what surface, I tried it on different surfaces, um, it slides like that. And when you put your phone in there, it's going to slide faster. Okay? I could not get it to work any other way. Okay, so that's, if that's going to bother you, this may not be the, the one for you. Okay, also, there, you know, you can kind of maybe get a... a a pan or something, you know, a lid or something to hold it where it doesn't go any further if you want. If you do that, you know, as long as you got this, these three points where they won't do this once you put your phone in there, and it's only for a smartphone, um, the adapter piece up here. This is only for a smartphone right there. So what's going on here is this is for the smartphone, but it comes off and you can easily interchange that for one that will work for an iPad, you know, like the pad pads. Um, this opens, you got about four inches of space in there approximately. Um, I'm going to put a link that's got all the dimensions and everything to the website. Um, you know, and like I said, this comes and turns easy, one click, and it, and it holds good, you know, like once your phone and stuff is in there. Um, you also got this little step here that comes up. If you notice as I twist it, it'll lock it in or let it go down. Okay, this is as high as it comes. Um, and it does, you know, take some, you know, when your phone gets on there, it's not going to go down. It stays locked in place. So you just put wherever you want it. Just keep on. Okay, all that's in great working spots. Okay. The remote control. This is what it looks like. And it pops out of this little rubber thing real quickly and easy. It's not hard to get out. Um, it's got this little indention, and it also has a little ditch in here, and you're going to put that in first and go like this and pop it in to lock it. Um, all this is going to allow you to do that I could find. I couldn't get mine to do nothing more than but snap it and take a picture like you do after you sync it in Bluetooth. Like you do a selfie sticks, that's all this is going to do. And don't expect it to focus in, out, turn on and off. I was unable to get mine to do that. If you could find it to do that, great, let me know. Because I've been playing with this since yesterday. Um, I've been using it for a couple of weeks, but I've been really trying to get this thing to work. And I couldn't. Um, other than that, you know, I have to say it is good quality. This is not cheap plastic. This is not cheap metals. This is not cheap nothing. Everything for 50 bucks. $49.99 is what I paid off the Social Light website. Um, I have similar things like this, and I have to say this still tops them, and I am very happy. Now, this here, you have to unscrew. 
You know, it's not the ones that you just pop in and out. So if you like the ones that pop in and out, you can still get this and just screw this off and put the other one on. So you got the, those options. This goes landscape or portrait either, either way. But it's strictly for iPhone. But um, again, this is uh, what I feel is if you're doing stuff like at a desk, like well, what, I, what I'm doing right now, or makeup or crafting, you know, it's great because you can like put your, lock it in place and then, you know, put it to wherever you want on it. So there's a lot of variations you can do with it. So I would think, that, I mean, I would recommend this as an addition to your um, tripods and, and filming equipment for 50 bucks. And because things are interchangeable with other universal pieces, it is a great investment, I feel. And, um, you know, like I said, I, I paid $20 for something that's, that I'm using right now that's got my phone in it filming here, and I'll do a video on that in a minute. And I paid $20 for that. <laughs> and, and it's only just to hold the phone. This gives me many more other options to do. So, uh, yeah, I recommend it. And uh, I'll put the link and information down. But I just wanted to note a few things that you should know before actually purchasing it. Don't expect this thing to be real high up. This is a selfie filming device thing, but it does have where you can extend and add to it. So that's a plus.